It's time for Dutch Oven Cooking with C-Dub. Here's your host, C.W. Butch Welch. What I'm doing here now, I've got the Camp Chef uh, wok, and this is a, uh, a turtle shell iron. It's very lightweight, but you still have the benefit of cooking with iron. And both of our recipes today are taking uh, some, some chicken that we want to brown up. So... We're going to make our black bean and chicken soup over here, and it's we're using the, the lid for our Camp Chef Ultimate Turkey Roaster for that, and then we will transfer chicken over into here as we, uh, uh, for our chicken lasagna that we'll make. So uh, we're just going to stir fry some chicken and uh, get everything ready. For the black bean and chicken soup, we want to uh, just stir fry here in our wok a little bit of onion and garlic and we'll add that over here to the pot we're making our soup in and uh, then we'll come back and do that last little bit of chicken and we'll start making our lasagna. And really all we need our onions and garlic for on this soup is just to the soft stage and so it's getting pretty close there. We're going to put that in here for our black bean and chicken soup. We've already got the chicken. We browned our chicken, our onions, and our garlic in another segment, in the earlier segment. So all we're going to do, we're going to add three cans of black beans that are drained. And uh, this is a real quick, simple soup. We have used this uh, at a lot of our demos and clinics, and boy, people just really like it. We're going to add two cans of chicken broth. And three cans of uh, Mexican diced tomatoes with some green chilies. You know, and if you're cooking for a crowd that likes it hot, you can add some uh, jalapenos or serranos or something like that for a little more heat. But that's going to be all it takes for this soup. We're going to stir this up. And for seasoning, we're just going to do a little salt and pepper uh, and some cumin. Cumin is one of my favorite spices and you can take almost any dish and add a little cumin and give it a southwest flavor. So we're just going to sprinkle some in there. Probably about a teaspoon there, maybe a little less. A little bit of salt. This is something that people can add on their own and I know a lot of chefs and cooks out there use a lot more salt, but uh, I guess, you know, different styles. A little pepper is all we're going to use there. We're going to stir that up and go over here on our Camp Chef stove and just get this to simmering with the meat browned the way we did. Uh, this isn't going to take very long to cook. Okay, and I'd say that's about right. I'm going to need to take a spoon with me over here. Okay, we're just going to set that down here on our stove, get our burner going on about medium heat. We're going to use a, a lid for our Camp Chef skillet. It fits our soup pot perfect. Okay, we're 